All right, this is going to be a Marvel comic book lot. Conan the Barbarian. I have like about 52 issues, roughly, and I'm going to do the issues in order of what I have. This one's from 1973. They're all the way from 1973 until like the mid-80s. And I love these comics. If you ever get a chance, if you love sword and sorcery, fantasy, and Roy Thomas wrote a lot of these early ones. So this is the first one I have. It's issue number 30, as you can see. It's called The Devil Beast of Negral. Issue number 41, The Garden of Death and Life. And Roy Thomas is one of my favorite Marvel writers that they had during the Bronze Era. He became the succeeding editor to Stan Lee. That's how respected he was. This one features gargoyles. A lot of these issues, it's just Conan wandering around and then he'll... This one features the Red Sonja. They ended up making a comic book based off of that. A oh, comic book movie featuring her in the 80s. The Demon of Dark Valley. He'll fight mostly wizards and monsters and everything kind of beast you can see. This is a wizard spawn. Mostly he'll... And there's a, he fights a bunch of giants too. Number 47, The Goblin Strike at Midnight. Unos, the man witch whose eyes deal death. This is one I wrote down that I wanted to read for sure. Pull up, look on the back of this one, Evil Knievel ad. Number 52, The God in the Crypt. Number 57, A Barbarian Chained. Okay, this is Fiends of the Feathered Serpent. I wanted to read this because it featured the serpent in it. Total biblical reference. Oh my god, there's so many fantasy and witchcraft good lines and scenes as you can. Then this is what ended up happening. One of the writers or pencilers got sick, so they did a reprint of The Secret of Skull River. And this is one of the best stories ever. It features like Conan and this wizard who's like doing alchemy and he's like poisoning. That's why they call it Skull River. And he's like poisoning the lake and the whole town is oppressed by his reign. And he's trying to like resurrect this god idol with this, with this like perfect chemistry of liquid to resurrect them. And it's like the dopest story ever. That's Conan number 64. So it doesn't even feature this story. It is a reprint of, I forget which story it is. Let's see here. Number 66, Dagon got a death. King Cole, number 68. Look at he fights King Cole, the other famous barbarian. Number 69. The Demon from Deep. A lot of these weren't even called the what the name title that they'd have on the page. That would kind of be like a tagline almost. Death ten feet tall. I was obsessed with Giants and I read all the Conan ones featuring that. Number 78 also features Red Sonya. Total pentagram. Let's see here. Number 94. He fights Lions. Number 100. Looks like he fights pirates. Every time I open it, it's like a free. Oh, that's dope. The artwork is total top notch, typical Marvel of the time. Really good writing, really good narrative. I love these comic books. Here we go, the back end. Number 109. And then check into part two of this video and I'll go over the rest of the Conan videos.